guys happy new year well happy new year's eve <laughs> happy new year guys well happy new year's eve and welcome back to my channel but if you are new here welcome to my channel my name is alicia pink at aliciapink.com okay so i'm going to be talking about how to petition how to write a powerful petition for the new year guys how to manifest the life you want for the new year you know i feel like today is perfect timing to it's not too late to do your manifestation goals and your rituals um it's perfect timing for it you know it's the new year the new year is right around the corner you know i know you guys are excited for tonight i am i can't wait for 2020 to get here you know and you can start today by writing down your affirmations and your petitions and your goals and your new year's resolutions today and i'm going to tell you guys how you can do that so first things first you know um take it seriously you know if you are going to write a petition um take it seriously because everything is energy and what you write down will manifest so be extremely specific about what you want and um tell the universe what you want take it very seriously guys you know um I'm going to quote my girl Erica Badu. Okay, I love her. <laughs> she says, when you write it down on real paper with a real pencil, watch shit happen. Okay, my girl Erica Badu. I love her. She's always quoting amazing things and she is extremely spiritual and she's my spirit animal. She is also a Pisces just like me. I freaking love that woman. Okay, so yes, when you write it down on real paper, okay, watch shit happens. Okay, it will get real in these streets. <laughs> okay, guys, um, you know, write down your goals. You know, write down what you want to accomplish for 2020. There's also one thing you can do. You can also, you know, write down your goals, write down what you want for 2020. You know, also you can um, record what you want in your, um, your, with your voice. Go to your voice recorder if you have, everybody has a phone, everybody has a voice recorder on a phone. So go to your voice recorder on your phone and um, in your own voice, saying i am and i have in present tense like what you're trying to manifest you know like say like i am you know i am a millionaire i am successful you know i have a beautiful home you know things like that like i am making fifty thousand dollars a month you know i have a successful business things like that you know and just write it write it also record it on your voice recorder and listen to it while you well before you go to bed you know while you are sleeping you know you want to reprogram the mind re reprogram the subconscious mind and get that programming in your head and tell the universe that yes i am manifesting this this is what i want this is what i am receiving you know for 2020 um, you know, you can also use the 33 times 3 method. I actually did a video about that. I will link it down below for you guys to watch. Um, you can use that method. You know, it is a simple, easy method. You know, first things first, you can choose what type of affirmation you want. For example, like, um, I am receiving $1,000 this week or three thousand dollars this week or two hundred dollars whatever you're trying to manifest you know i am receiving it you know and then you um write it down for um 33 times for three days 
and you know on any piece of paper it can be a white piece of paper parchment paper whatever paper you want you know just write it down for 33 write it 33 times um for three days and um then let it go let the universe um do its job basically forget about it that's the best way to manifest something is to do the work and forget about it write it down forget about it okay so that's also one thing you can do so when also, you are writing a petition um you like i said like i said before you could use any type of paper you can use white paper parchment paper brown paper so you know i personally like to use parchment paper and brown paper because i believe that it manifests quickly when you use brown paper but you can use whatever type of paper you want you know um you can use a sharpie or a pen i personally like to use a sharpie um because i love the black ink you know and the black the black um i feel like it manifests faster you know um you um when you write it down make sure it feels right you know make sure you don't have any fear in your heart any you're not doubting it at all because if you do it will not work it will not work at all if you are doubting yourself you should just stop right there and try again either later on that day or the next day or just take time to manage med meditate and really try to feel it and like know that is yours because if you don't believe that is yours it won't happen no matter how many times you try you know because you have to know that is yours because the universe works with you um they want to give you what you want but they want to make sure that is actually what you want you know um it won't happen if you have fear or if you doubt in yourself you know don't force it into your life because you need to be careful what you wish for because you just might get it you know like that song with the pussycat dolls that i used to love uh, when, when i grow, I grow up, up i want to be famous i want to be a star i want to be in movies <laughs> and like like be careful what you wish for because you just might get it yeah guys so make sure <laughs> that this is something that you truly want okay because you just might get it like if you're trying to manifest like um a specific partner into your life like a loved one or a lover into your life make sure that's the person that you want in your life okay make sure that that's the person that you want because if they're not the person that you want then you know you might manifest some other stuff into your life stuff that you don't want like a crazy partner abusive partner who knows because you need to make sure that you are specific about the person the partner that you want in your life you know what is what their age is what they do for a living how they're going to treat you how their personality is what they do for a living you know um will y'all be compat y'all make sure that y'all are compatible with each other and um that you guys you know have a healthy loving relationship you know you don't want to manifest somebody into your life just because you like the way they look or you know or just because they have money or whatever you want to ma manifest someone who is going to treat you right who is going to love you who is going to respect you who is going to have your best interests in heart and vice versa okay um also you know when you know what you want be you know like i said be very specific also write down the date and the time you know um and visualize what you want you know um feel it taste it you know know that like yes this is this is mine okay i already got it you know it's already here you know if you could visualize it it's already yours if you could visualize yourself doing it anything is possible it's already yours it's going to happen um you know um these are the things that are coming into your life now you know so make sure that you know when you do sign the paper and you know sign your signature sign the date and sign, um, sign the time the time because you want these things to come into your life now 
you know it's like signing a document like a legal document to the universe you know so just basically just make sure that like i said this is what you want you know if you're trying to manifest your dream job you know be very specific about that as well you know um talk about what type of job you want um what are you going to be doing at that job um how much money you're going to be making um where are you do you want to work from home do you want to work in the office do you want to work at a hospital do you want to work do you want to have your own business be very what type of business you are going to want you just not say oh i just want to manifest the business what type of business do you want like you know what type of business you would want what do you want do you want to have an online store do you um want to have a non-profit company or just um i don't know whatever business you want make sure it's specific make sure you know that's the type of business that you want um you know if you want to be working from home what type of work are you going to be doing from home um you know do you want a clothing line do you want to have your own nail salon your own beauty store or beauty supply store or hair salon i don't know on your own production company like what exactly do you want and be very specific and write it down um like it's already yours so also if you want to manifest a home when you are writing down your petition you can you also have to be specific about the type of home you want what type of environment you want to be living in you know like um you know what type of home you know you want how big your home will be how many rooms your home will have you know um how are you going to design each room you know um how's your living room going to look what type of kitchen you want what type of bathrooms do you want um do you want guest houses or do you do you want a big garage do you want a big big backyard do you want a pool um visualize it to the t like how the staircase is going to look you know um how you want to design your home how you are going you know how the walls are going to look you know how your house is going to smell you know how much your house will be what type of environment what type of neighborhood you want to um your house to be you know um what art is going to be on the walls of your your house you know you have to be extremely specific guys very specific if you want to write a powerful petition and if you really want to manifest it and make it a reality and make it come true last but not least is scripting i love scripting guys so scripting 101 i'm going to give you guys the basic scripting 101 <laughs> you know so scripting is a powerful law of attraction technique where you write a story about your life and um, based on what you want, want it to be. You know, so you are basically writing your story. So, you know, you are telling your story exactly as you want. Scripting requires you to write your story as if it is, has already happened. You know, focusing on how you would feel when you desire what you have manifested so like i said before you have to feel it you have to visualize it you have to taste it you have to know what you want you know so for example you if you want to manifest like a trip or something like i even i want to manifest a trip i would love to go to paris that's one of my dream um places to go so you know i would even love to live in paris as well I love Paris. I want to go to Paris. I want to experience it. You know, so for example, like say, um, you know, I want to manifest a trip to Paris, you know, so like I am so grateful now that I have traveled to Paris 
and saw the Eiffel Tower for the first time. I took pictures with my loved ones and my family or whoever you want to be with. If you want to be alone, just say I took pictures in front of the Eiffel Tower. You know, I went out to dinner. I ate at all of the beautiful restaurants. I ate dinner at the Eiffel Tower. You know, write down what you was wearing. Like, oh, I had a beautiful red burgundy dress on and how your makeup was, how how your hair was, how your nails was, how your shoes was. You know, um, like, oh, I visit this place, that place. I stayed at this hotel. I, um, you know, I shopped at this place. You know, I had this type of breakfast. I had this type of lunch. I had this type of dinner. You know, things like that be very specific and, you know, just because it will come true if you truly believe that it will come true. You know, um, and once you have written your petition and you are confident about it and you know that this is going to happen and that you um, feel it and you are, you don't have any doubts, any fears, you know, um, write down the date again write down the time that you write down the date that you wrote down wrote the petition write down the time you wrote down a petition and um sign your name um like you are signing the legal document so sign your signature like your first your middle name your last name if you want to put down your birth date you can do that as well i like put it on my birth date um you know and leave it alone and let the universe work you know so just forget about it don't don't dwell on it don't say oh my god when is this gonna come oh my god this is taking too long like oh my it's because if you do that it, it, you might as well forget about it so just like just leave it alone and just let the universe work let the universe do its magic you know because the universe is in your favor and it does want to bring you what you want in life you just have to truly believe it okay guys so yes i just wanted to say happy new year again <laughs> this is what i'm going to be wearing guys when the new year comes happy new year <laughs> happy new year and i hope you guys um have a great new year cheers to 2020 you know we are going to be manifesting in 2020 we're not going to be work um living paycheck to paycheck in 2020 we're going to be starting our businesses in 2020 we're going to be working on our dream jobs in 2020 we're going to be buying houses and cars and all that good stuff we're going to be getting married we're going to have babies we're going to be doing all that in 2020 okay so if you truly believe that it's going to happen, it's going to happen, guys. And this is the last video for 2019. I am so happy. And um, yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And happy new year. Bye.